Good morning, Buford High. I'm Emmett. And I'm Paul. Today is Thursday, December 12th. And this is your Buford High Morning News. The annual alumni basketball game will be held on Sunday, December 22nd at 2.30 p.m. Come out for an afternoon of fun. Cost is $5 at the gate. The informational meeting to discuss the field trip to New York and Washington, D.C. will be tonight from 6 to 7 p.m. in Mr. Mill's room in 1230. The Cupcake Wars results are in. There is a back and forth race between Home for the Holidays and Welcome to Whoville for the popular vote. The popular student vote helped decide our first place winner, which was Home for the Holidays team, which consisted of Carolyn Durance, Hollis Langford, Grayson Bridges, Aaron Cohen, and Macy Mullen. Winners won $20 gift cards each for Saltus, Hearth, or Plums. Teachers, however, unanimously voted for Happy Feet for best tasting cupcakes, and each student received $5 gift cards from Cook on Bay. T team included Zoe Polishan, Ryan Cook, Gia Navarro, Zoe Creek, and Michael Aboras Racinos. Congratulations! The sophomore class will be selling Christmas cookies outside the cafeteria during all lunches this week. The cost is $1 for two cookies. Don't miss this opportunity to satisfy your holiday sweet tooth. Voices Chorus and the Sion Sound Band will present a holiday concert titled A Cozy Christmas tonight at 6.30. There will be plenty of music and even a visit from Sam! Oh my god! Santa here? I know him! It missing we $5. Wear your favorite festive sweater and celebrate the season with some music. Join us on a field trip to the Charleston Dock Street Theater on January 28th to see The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Seats are limited. See Ms. Corbett in room 1221 for a permission slip. The Personal Finance Challenge is a statewide online competition testing middle and high school students on their knowledge of personal finance literacy. Topics included earning income, protecting and insuring, using credit, buying goods and services, and saving and financial investing. Students from Miss Marshall's personal finance class took third place in the challenge. Team Sugar Bears, which includes Tiana Blackman, Malia Johnson, Nyasia Reed, and Zaheem Scott, will each receive a $25 check. They are also invited to attend a formal award ceremony on May 15th at the Darla Moore School of Business in Columbia, South Carolina. Way to go! AFJRTC is hosting a Christmas food drive from December 9th through the 13th and would like to invite everyone to participate and help during the holiday season. The items needed are canned foods, boxed goods, and non-perishable dry goods. Collection boxes will be placed in the front lobby of the school and next to the cafeteria. Donations will go towards families in need during the upcoming holiday seasons. The Crazy Ugly Holiday Sweater Contest is today. Use the Google Classroom code KJNDPI to upload a picture of you wearing the sweater. The top three sweaters will win a prize. NHS members should check Google Classroom for service. One set, three, two. Applications for Spanish National Honor Society are due to Ms. McKay in room 2119 by the end of the day Friday. Those who have applied for Spanish National Honor Society will receive a letter of acceptance next week and will meet following the announcement. Freshman Student Council will be doing a raffle from December 10th through 12th during all lunch days for five students to win three no uniform days. There will also be a staff raffle for three staff members to win three jean days. Tickets will be one dollar for one or five dollars for six. The French National Honor Society is having a coat drive from now until January 10th. Bring your new or gently used coats, jackets, and outerwear to Madame Marshall's room 1220. Merci beaucoup. The Youth and Government class is raising money to purchase toys and supplies for the Beaufort Animal Humane Society. Candy cane grams will be sold during lunch Wednesday through Friday for $1. Candy canes will be given to your fourth period class on Monday, so make sure you know the fourth block teacher. They will also be selling baked goods Wednesday through Friday during fourth block. If you would like to donate any supplies, please drop them off to Mr. Miller in room 1230. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will meet Friday morning at 8.10 in the small auditorium. HOSA will begin selling candy grams during all lunches Monday and Tuesday next week. Regular candy grams are $1. For $2, you can send an authentic Christmas wrapping candy gram featuring Dr. B.S. Biggie Smith and his final performance here at Beaufort High School. For $5, you can send three of Biggie's greatest hits including Christmas in the Hood, Decking My Crib, Bells in the Hood, 
and from the album Biggie Sings the Blues and ever requested Walking in the Winter in the Hood, see any host of members for details. Fellowship of Christian Athletes will meet tomorrow morning at 810 in the small auditorium. Hey Eagles, Justin here with your sports news. The Lady Eagles basketball team defeated Ridgeland Hardyville 45 to 26, led by Layla Warren with 27 points, Quinn Wilson with 5 points. The boys team lost 53 to 46. Zyron Odom led the way with 16 points and 7 rebounds. Jamad Rivers added 13 points. JV girls and boys basketball will travel to Well Branch for games at 6 and 7:30. That's your sports news. Go Eagles. Please stand for the pledge of allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for a moment of silence. Thanks for watching your Buford High Morning News. Have a nice day.